Hi guys, welcome back or welcome to my channel. My name is Kayla. If this is your first time here, if it is not your first time here, welcome back to my channel. Definitely make sure to subscribe. So in today's video, I'm going to be taking you on one of the most scenic hikes that I go on very often. This part of Harman that we are currently on, it's called Mia. So <laughs> we have a little bit of technical difficulty. <laughs> Before I even continue, how could I not introduce you? So today we have our special guest, which is Bea. 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 Hello. So throughout the video, you'll see him properly right now, he just wants to be on his own beat. You will get a better look of him, like throughout the video right now, he's just not cooperating. Right yeah, now, he's a little camera shy, so yeah. he wants to be behind the scenes. And my next guest that I have today is Jesse, yeah. everyone's favorite. No. Yes, you are. <laughs> yeah, I'm fine, I'm a camera voice. Look at them, they're so cute. So you can probably see him now. Say hi. Here's some yam. Oh my god. It's a live tripping all over. It's like water. Sure. Oh my gosh. Sure. Look at you. Yes, look at the camera. Look at this little skinny tree. Look at the big boulder. It's holding back. Scary, right? Mm -hmm. Wow. Do you think it'll come down if the tree moves? Of course. Actually, no, I don't think so. Actually, I don't know. So I should shut up. <laughs> yeah, so currently. In Trinidad and Tobago, there's a stigma. There's always been this stigma about pit bulls and Rottweilers, right? Currently, we had a bad incident. I'm not going to speak on it much. But if you train your dog to attack and kill any foreign object, your dog will do that when that threat is there, you know? So, who is really to blame, you know? But Bear here, he's such a darling. Okay, now I have dribble all over my glasses. <laughs> Could you see that? That's his spit. Okay, so now we are now starting the trail. Growing up, I would have picked these and bring it for my mommy every morning after daycare. Oh, these just bring back memories. And then the sun is also rising. So. If you don't know, this is called a chupa. So this is where gardeners will... Oh, I get so scared. I'm like, what the hell is that? <laughs> so as you can see, Bear, <laughs> he already went and checked out the chupa. You like it? Okay. So yeah, so chupa is where the gardeners will put all their chemicals and stuff for their garden. And over here, this person has a field of cabbages. And then over there, they have tomatoes. The cabbages are not good yet, like they have maybe two more weeks to go on and then they will be ready to pick. That's an avocado tree. Look at this view. So breathtaking. 
JC's getting his morning stretch on. Look at these stairs, they're cool, right? I want this. Look at this. Stairs made of tire. Yeah. Look up, they have a, another Jupa. This one is smaller. And you can see he has size. Ooh. What other crop you could see? Oh, you might think it's bush, but it's not really bush. That's rosemary. And then I could see he also has some thyme. Those little shrubs there. Right? Over there. I believe it's either Portugal or orange tree. No, I think it's a Portugal tree. It's a lemon. That's not a lemon tree. Look how huge those things are. And they expect it to be Portugal. <laughs> so along this trail you'll also see a lot of bamboos. It's so beautiful. And then you'll hear like the creaking. And I will always think it's like a monkey. I believe Dongye has monkeys, but we never saw them before. But I believe it has because these creaking noise. I know like it's natural for the bamboo to me to be making that noise, right? But all the time so that's sketch. Or it could be a sukunia. If you don't know Parmen is <laughs> if you don't know Parmen is huge for folklore. I believe in it. You believe in it? No, I don't. So it has a range of things. Sukuya, larger blast, twins are my favorite because I I I saw them once in all. Lie again. Lie 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 I'll do a story time on that. I saw them once. You saw them once. No, Kila, listen. My brother, listen, you're, my you're, older. You're, you're a church going person. <laughs> you, you know, no, no, you saw that one. Yeah. Okay, let me hear. My older brother and older sister as well, they used to torture me with when so like in the morning when we used to be getting ready for school, right? We would have had to go outside because if you know country living, you have to go outside to bed, right? Because back in the day, we didn't have no indoor toilet, no indoor shower, right? So we had to go outside in the back by the latrine, right? And I'm not ashamed to say that, right? Be proud where you come from and also remember where you come from right so anyways some mornings we had to go outside to take a shower so my sister and older brother will always come bed first because they wake up earlier than me right then when it was, when it was my turn to go on bed they'll always be like kayla let's have the twins outside and i was like are you serious and i used to be like peeping through the window and then like they'll be like look it's that shadow thing right there and i used to be seeing this shadow thing you know no but you saw the doing they said i saw it so they said the shadow thing <laughs> was the twin, so then I saw it. So then it's a, sh a shadow. You ever saw one? No, exactly. Right, so you don't know. So, yes. You don't know. <laughs> but that's exactly my point. You didn't see it either. They told you that you saw it. Well, my whole life I believe in I saw a twin, so I'm not wrong. I'm not the wrong one here. Okay, so if you reach down by the river and now... Yes, yes. They won't be out this hour. <laughs> yeah, they Sorry. roam the streets from 3 a.m. to 6 a.m. <laughs> it is currently 6.47. Alright, so do just watch the time. <laughs> <laughs> eh? So do just watch the time and say, hey, shit, go, like, time to go back inside. Yes, because they can't be in sunlight. Same as Asha Bless, they can't be in sunlight or else it will burn their skin. Right. Okay. Okay. It's not like you had a theory, don't I? <laughs> it's not that theory, Jesse. This is our culture. I don't know why Jesse acting so. This is our culture. We grew up learning this about. First of all, we learned it from our grandparents, right? Then from schools. In schools, we had to learn this and do projects about them. Yeah, but I think our parents and grandparents were just out of it, like carrying on tradition, which caused them to be panicking, like they can't sleep. You know. You have to turn it to you. So no. what you're saying now? What you're saying? No, I think that they just taught it us as young youths and it's time for us to change the culture because it is be scary to be like current gone and everybody talking about duens and things like but that. But I don't see anything bad about folklore. I like it's it. It's frightening. It's mysterious. It's intriguing. I love it. So you like being intrigued? Yes. And being scared. And I being love like, that. And the mystery about it is that like we really don't know what it looks like, you know? Exactly. It's just from and then pictures. Just, they, they, so, Jesus, it could be one. I think <laughs> can control children's mind by, um, like, don't go outside because the twin go gear you. But, you see, look at how much things we do normally controlling children's lives. Look at how much things we do. Yeah, name them. But it's just an additional thing that children will never, you'll never come a day and say, you know what I was telling you about twins? I lied. They never, you know, so it just continues. So then was the point that I'm watching Peppa Pig? 
and SpongeBob. No child won't believe it have a Peppa Pig and a SpongeBob. Yes, some children believe so. Show them my, my real legs. I've what? been walking and facing this way all the time. Wow, I never came this fast. Oh, okay. Look at that. Memphis, come out from there, please. <laughs> In case you all don't know, Memphis is not like any ordinary L dog. He's down very down. sloppy. And he will fall. And when Do he falls, he will give me the um his puppy eyes. <laughs> so he'll be holding on like Scar. No, not Scar. Simba. <laughs> and then, it's, yeah, and then he'll be giving me puppy eyes like, JC, save me. But look at the drop. Where you going? And you see? <laughs> you always fearful when he doesn't see me. Mm. Yeah? Yeah. So you see in that mountain there, behind the peak? Yeah. So that's Tego Martin. And then behind that mountain will be Carnage. Yeah. Mm. We could see the sea, you know, I think it's just too foggy to see the sea. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, we have something way more interesting than... You like the hair nice. Yeah, so we have something really nice that you're about to see soon. This is like the highlights of Mia. So, stay tuned. Keep watching. Cool. Hello! Hello, Kupu! Kupu! Look at the camera! Look at the camera! Hold on, hold on, hold on. I am very blessed that this route is open to me and it's like when you have a stressful week you know and when you come on this hike it's just so breathtaking like all the views it's so breathtaking it's so scenic I am not the most knowledgeable about this area so I can't tell you the rich history so come along with me there's more to see stay tuned as I was telling you earlier this trail is filled with bamboos like everywhere you turn I was actually very nervous about hiking this morning because the weather looks so rainy but something was something was telling me it was just a passing cloud why get done calling me something um chill anyway so the sky was overcast so I was like okay the rain is for sure coming but how you know the rain wasn't coming how you know it was a passing cloud because recently it's been dark in the mornings when I wake up oh okay I don't wake up early so I guess that's why I don't know Okay. Yeah. Okay, everybody. So we are hearing a little bit of noise. That's the one. So I believe when rain falls, at times water comes straight. In this area. I think it comes down here, all here. It bends, hit the banks, and then it. Oh, the drains clog it, up. Yeah, it enters this canal here. But this area is, well, obviously, a very rural. Um, yeah. Hey, but thank God for roads, eh? <laughs> yeah, thank God for roads. Up this road, a lot of people have their gardens, so you can see the trails. Most people in this area have jeeps, right? If you didn't know. And as you know, jeeps are like off-road vehicles and it's perfect for this type of terrain. So you can see the trail. So I'm pretty sure somebody is in the garden already because people don't make no joke about their garden. Six o'clock, they're in their garden already. You want that? Mm, this could be breakfast. We could do this with some toast. And this is Wait, where the water enters, where the canal Look at how all here mash up. So as you can see, it have these slabs of cement, like a dung there, faucet mash up. I never saw this before. Mm -hmm. Well, it's been some time since I come down here. You got your shit man. disgusting. So this is under the road yeah. yeah. So it's heaving in. Yeah, we have a little inspect yeah, here as well. One drink you think now, Memphis? Thank you. 
Oh, he's right there. You really like his attention. I like you have a little waterfall. So over here, if you want to have your cookout, your curry, how do, where does cook by the river? Curry goat? Yeah. Right, if you want to do that, have a nice cookout on a Saturday. You come here, as you can see, you have a table over there. You have two tables, and then here you have a sitting area. You know, so while Papa and them cooking, you sit down and you wait for the food to get cooked. I don't think people will come and just sit down and wait. I think they'll sit down and drink. Sit down and take a drink, a, sh a punch in. <laughs> That's how it's good. But like I say, yeah, and you can see that over there had another bench, but like it broke down for whatever reason. Yeah, and look at that. And here's just a sneak peek of the waterfall. Okay, <laughs> not over there. Let's be amazed by the the. And over here, trees. that that's the sneak. Peek to the waterfall! So, how about we go to the normal area first? It's kind of risky to go to the next area. I don't think we're going to go to the next area. Let's just go to the safe zone first. Okay, hold on. Come. We have a star with a new one. He's so cute. Come on this side, come on please. Mm -hmm. Wow, look at this. <laughs> Bae, you have to go <laughs> and finish, speed. Oh my gosh! You have to go and bed! <laughs> so over the past few weeks it had heavy rainfall, like it was really bad. This is just one little impact. And I say little because there has been worse things that had happened. Right, so this tree fell down and it blocked the road. I don't know if they cut the tree so we could to pass. Look, look at him, he didn't even finish his bat. Ooh, look at this! And then it also has a trail up here. Do you all want to go? I know all you want to see what's up here, so let's go and see. Oh, how do I cross here, boy? Okay, I made it across. Did I wet my feet? Yes, I did. My cousins and I, we used to come down here. I actually made a vlog about us coming down here, you know, but I never posted. Those were. Oh, he has some frogs. Look at that. Are you seeing that? Yeah, but this area has a lot of tadpoles. So you will be seeing a lot of frogs. Ooh! It's really dark up here though, so I don't want to go up too far. It's really nice. I actually have a picture with me on this rock with bear. When I find it, I will include it like right here. I will show you the picture. So cute. It was maybe quite back in 2019, I believe. And it just keeps going up. Look at that. Every time I have come here, the waterfall has never been this high. Like, I could actually see a pool. Yeah, I'm by myself in the back here. So I don't want to stay too long. JC is still in Memphis, so. It's our old frog here. Water. Look like a bear. <laughs> yeah. As I was saying earlier, I actually made a vlog already of us as well. Me and my cousins and also JC was there to remember. When we came here and we had to swim across here and then go up on top. But as I said, I've never seen the water float this high. The water is really deep. Looking there. <laughs> oh 
Oh my gosh! Uh, I'm even for a dog. Look at my... Look at my thing! Oh my... What is your problem, dude? Jesse, look, you're going in the cobweb. Did you see that? Look at all the type of things I do in fall here. Yeah. So I'm climbing up this mountain to show all yeah, how the next side is. Okay, I made it. So this is the back. It has a similar pool to the one right down there. Hey, watch me. It's really nice. Oh, I can't wait for the Prime Minister to open up the beaches and waterfalls and thing all year. I know all they want the beaches to open. Yeah. So normally if we were like come in here to like bathe and lime and thing, we would swim through this pool here to reach in the back here. I have never went beyond that point. Like on top I've never been there the furthest I've ever been. It's probably like right here. So it has an extreme up this way to the left. So, Jesse's going to see what there has. We have never been up there before. Well, I have never been up there. Jesse, you went up there before? Yeah, but it's, it's, it's just, it's not that big. <laughs> oh. Like, red, it was red, red. We're in the jungle. If all you know the name of this tree, please tell me. I'm going to take a picture for my grandfather. Maybe he could help me out. I love this. Jesse, you see this plant? Yeah, look, and I come. Parsley, yeah? Yeah. I love this. Let me take a picture. He's going in the back there. Look at him. So Memphis went in the bush. And wow, he's enjoying his dog. time. Oh? Really and Kayla is here. Look at the, the trees moving. Yeah, he's just here exploring and Kayla is okay. here. You have a picture on it? Bear living in his own way. Look, <laughs> he vomit? Look, these pink things come out, or those rocks. No, that is vomit. Ew. So, do you know what's the name of this fruit? This one is bad, but this is called a kashuma, if you don't know. Look at this stem. This leaf is, does not belong to it, so. I had one the other day for the first time and it actually tasted so good, it was nice and sweet. But this one is not good so I can't show you the inside, it's not good. So, happy go! There's an axe here! <laughs> look at him, look at him, where he going? He's smart, where he going on? Pass you there. Can't find a way. Get a jump down, jump jump! Bye! Okay, so this route I know nothing about. Apparently, this water here goes to a waterfall that looks amazing. I've seen it in pictures though. So this is the... So, once again, this, so this is the track. This track over here. We're looking for bear, but he's too scared to come down. Okay, so if it wasn't here, maybe four as I said. Look at him, look at him, look at him. So... He had to come around. So as I was saying, here is the truck, so we have to climb up, go across, and then go down. Oh. Okay, hold on. I've never seen something like this before. We got him! Yay! Okay, so if you remember from earlier when I was mentioning the cookouts and the benches and the tables, it's right on top there, and we are on a lower level right now. So now we're going to the waterfall, the most exciting part. You made it? You good? Nice. Any other spot? I won't say so. Listen, listen. <laughs> oh. Oh. Wow, this is a sneak peek all here. Sneak peek. Yeah, there's the most narrow path. Huh? Yeah, there's the most narrow path. You're scared? Yeah. You're afraid of height? Yeah. Jesse just pulled onto the roots. The roots. You know, far down this is. The roots stronger than you, Jesse. Exactly. Right, so hold on to oh. them. 
it is, see? Stop acting like me. All right. <laughs> Hold on to the roots. You good? Yeah, you know, man. Memphis, come. Go down quick here. Okay, so this is all downhill. This is level here, and this is where Kayla is. And if I must be honest, I find this very scary. They said, they said no joke, I was next expecting Kayla to be so normal about this, but I'm kind of scared. I don't know why they... Look, that was easy. Yeah, that was easy. <laughs> no, that's this easy. is the waterfall. Oh. Down there, it's like that's the river. So here's the waterfall. So recently, it had a fire that took place in Mia, and as you can see, the devastating impact of it. So you can see the burnt bamboo. Thankfully, it did not spread much. It was controlled rather quickly, which is all good to say. And yeah, and down they have, you know, more ravines, but um, we are not going there today. And there is the waterfall up there. because down here we're real cool right <laughs> it's so beautiful oh all that mud that's from there that's from there enjoying yourself well yeah um so it was really nice um i enjoyed the camera i enjoyed the attention you know um, everything everything today was just calm a nice way to start your day I uh, recommend it to anyone any one of you viewers out there I uh, know I'm new and I might not have built my credibility as yet but I tell you it's something that any, I think everybody should come and enjoy you know Mia Mia, Mia it is right? yeah yeah right yeah Mia um, yeah come on down come on down to Mia um, only looking at me now I think I might just go back and take another swim <laughs> Also, let me just quickly say we are not bathing. We did not come in bathing. Suits and socks. Can we cook? Trunk. We're not going to bathe because of the COVID restrictions currently in Trinidad and Tobago. We cannot bathe in any body of water. So. <laughs> but we have somebody here who doesn't really care. Yeah, he can bathe. So, yeah. Yeah, just wanted to say that. Don't want nobody coming here and saying. La, 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 la. Uh -oh. Yourself, my boy. What happened? What happened? I know, but no. I'm not going to go back on the train. You want to go back on it? Yeah. Why? You scared? No. Okay, this is. Oh, this is so good. No, I wish we could bid. I wish we could You have seen us reach our final destination. Well, not our final destination. Our final destination is home. But we have made it, and I'm so happy I got the opportunity to bring GC along. I came here once before and I've, I'm always telling him like we have to go, we have to go. But he was still so chicken about it all the time and he still was today. No, but there was good reason to be a chicken, eh? Yeah, it was scary. Only a slip and fall. As in, look at up there, that's where we were walking. Right here is where we were walking, eh? That's the trail. And then if we fall, this was right our... Here. This is what would have been our drop. So here. There was good reason to be fearful. <laughs> Um, would I recommend this to anyone? To be honest, no. I don't think children should be coming down here because big old me slipping and falling. You saw when I slip and fall? No, I couldn't miss it. <laughs> All I slip and fall. Imagine you go into a scary place and the tour guide falling. 
How that gonna make you feel? How that gonna make you feel? Anyways, I'm going to close out the video here. I hope you enjoyed our morning adventure to Mia. If you have made it this far and you have not yet subscribed, make sure and do so. I'm shouting because you want to follow her all out. So I hope all you can hear me good, right? Yeah, if you enjoyed this video, you better, you better like the video. So No, yeah, yeah. Really and truly, if you don't like and subscribe the video, then um, it don't make no sense uh, to watch. Yeah. yeah. If yeah. you watch anything from me, you're going to enjoy it, right? Yeah. And that's point blank. That's fine. Her. Period. Okay. So thank you so much for watching. This is to watch. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed once again. See you in our next adventure. Bye. Okay. We're saying bye on one, two, three, right? One, two, three. Bye. Okay. One. Nah, I'm not saying bye. I'm okay. Like... okay, guys. Bye. See you in my next video. Peace. Peace out. What's really scary about this adventure is that when I reached home, my brother informed us that one of his friends went down to the same waterfall the other day and saw this humongous snake. So yeah, that's really scary. But anyways, thank God we didn't see it. It might have seen us, but we did not see it. And to end of the morning, we had some refreshing coconut water awaiting us when we reached home. Um, Look, even Bear enjoyed yeah, himself. And now, here are the photos from the hike.